My name is Sarah Mukasa. I'm a Pan-Africanist feminist uh, from Uganda and I work for the Open Society Initiative for Eastern Africa. I have been involved in the feminist um, republic to the extent that my uh, views were sought on what kinds of things uh, this initiative um, should address within the context of uh, women's rights organizing in Africa. <laughs> We've been at this conference for two days and what is evident is that women's human rights defenders are tired, uh, they are exhausted because the work that they do is not simple work. No? It is work in which we have to deal daily with the struggles of African women on this continent. Violence, rape, you know, abandonment, you know, all of these things and very dangerous political um, situations. So the women who work to defend them often work in very dangerous conditions with very few resources and with very little support. So the people doing this work are often burnt out. They're often feeling isolated, depressed, all of these kinds of um, anxieties and so on. We need a space to be able to address those kinds of you know, uh, difficulties in order that we can help um, ourselves as women's human rights defenders to be able to do the work that we set ourselves up to do. So in that sense, for me, this is a vital space, absolutely vital space. We're all talking about, as women, of the importance of self-care, that we can't be looking after the entire community of women if we don't look after ourselves, if we don't address our own health concerns, if we don't give our t ourselves time to rest and recuperate, you know, if we don't uh, give, our, give ourselves time to switch off from the difficulties that we're trying to address. So this is why we're here. And as you can see, uh, many people, many, many, many sisters in the room are sharing stories um, of the difficulties that they have in doing this work. So for me, it is, it is a space that is long overdue. What I think is very powerful is when you get women in a space and they're able to share their stories as openly as possible in a space that supports them to be able to do that. Because we don't often have that permission, especially as African women. So for me, what I love to see is the stories of women coming forward and the space taking care of them and giving them the permission to do that. That's exciting for me.